Hi, welcome back. This is Zoe with Zoe Chat here on YouTube. And today I'm making this video because I am in Posh Shear Jail. This is my second time being in Posh Shear Jail. I don't know if any of you have ever been in Posh Shear Jail before, but I learned something new about Posh Shear Jail this morning. Not only can you not share things or add things to bundles for other people in today's closet clear out or put comments to people, you also cannot create listings and you can't even create drafts, <laughs> which was a surprise to me because I woke up this morning and I was in posh jail when I went to bed last night. So I knew this morning I'd probably still be in posh share jail. And it was, <coughs> excuse me. And so I was like, well, I'll just create a bunch of drafts. And as soon as I'm out of jail, I will make all of those go live. No, no, can't do it. Can't do it because when you're in posh share jail, you can't even make a draft. So actually you can make the draft and then when you go to save it, it won't let you. So you can waste your time thinking you're making a draft but you're not making a draft. So what did I do? I went to um, a thrift store that I've been meaning to try. And I have a pretty big haul and I got some pretty good stuff. So being a Posh Share Jail so far has sort of worked out for me. So this first item is this, let's see, big cowl neck with a zipper. It was asymmetrical zipper sweater with pockets on the side. And this is oversized, but this is soft surroundings. It's a size small, but it definitely feels bigger than a small. And this actually has a couple spots, but this was half off. So I'm gonna throw that in the wash and see what I can do with it. Here is my New England Preppy coming out. I can't help it, but this is a girl's Vineyard Vines, size 12. Look at this whale print. Oh my God. Cute little cutout in the back. This really nice lightweight cotton dress. Some little girl is gonna rock that this spring on the vineyard or on the ferry to Nantucket, looking fabulous. So these I had to get because I find this brand all the time, but I'm pretty sure I have never found this brand in this size before. So these are, it's hard to see because it's like purple on purple. These are Prana, the little Prana logo there. These are size large and they're these really cute purple Capri leggings with that fun speckled waistband and again, size large. So I'm psyched to give those a try. This was one of the half off things. And that was the other thing too. When I went to the Goodwill last time, the one that I normally go to, the half off color of the tag was red and I found one red tag. There were like no red tags in the whole store. And I get so irritated when there's the color of the day and then there's none of the color of the day in the store. And I always go to that store the moment they open. So there were no color of the day tags and they, and they still put a sign up that says the color of the day is half off and there is no of the color of the day. There was plenty of the color of the day today, which was yellow. And this is Eileen Fisher, and it's this brown long line jacket, and it's really lightweight with pockets, and it's got shoulder pads. This may even be vintage, but again, Eileen Fisher does pretty well for me, and size large, give that a shot. This is men's, this is <clears throat> Boss, Hugo Boss. It's a size medium. It's this really cute quarter snap. Next, he's got snaps, gray, Pullover, it's cotton. Again, nice for spring. <clears throat> cool spring evenings, you need a pullover. This was also half off, so this is not exciting, but I do pretty well with this brand. This is just Hurley. It's a size medium. Just this color block, gray and black. Sweatshirt with a kangaroo pocket. See how that does. This was, it is not men's, but it was with the men's. And this is a size extra, extra large. This is also soft surroundings. And this is this great yellow and gray, like space dye hood, long line pullover sweatshirt with a pocket on one side and that cute little slit in the front on the other side. And again, I thought that would be great for a spring, for an evening jacket, throw on. This I got because anyone who's watched me before knows I'm a sucker for Orvis, again, preppy. This is size large, it has this really cute contrast plaid on the inside, and then this chambray blue trim along the neck, and it's just a quarter zip, but again, size large, really nice. I have two boys in my family that are that size, so if that doesn't sell, it will have a home. I'm not worried about it. I have two preppy men in my family. Uh, these were a fun find. These were in the women's pants, but they are not women's. These are 511 Tactical, and they're 3630, which used to be my dad's size, but now he is a 3429, so 
too much information for anyone who knows my dad, but these pants wouldn't fit him. But these are really nice. These are like, have no wash wear. It's a really nice, like sharp black. And they are like cargo. They have these side pockets and they're like really durable, great, like outdoor or workwear pants. So I had to grab those. <coughs> Excuse me. These are one of the several winter items I got, but these are Obermeyer size eight. These are in great condition and they're these beautiful ski pants and they have zipper pockets in the front and zipper pockets on the back. And I know that also the real real takes Obermeyer and these are in such good condition that I may send them off there, but I don't know that I would send them off yet because um, the real real will just post them now. And if nobody's looking for ski pants, I'll end up getting like $5 for those. So I may post those myself and then like come fall, send them to the real real because on the real real, I'll probably be able to do pretty well with those. These are made well. And I actually got two of the exact same. These are 10 inch high rise skinny and they are 28 tall. So I hear a lot of people saying that they do well with like the tall size and these are in like excellent condition. The back patch is perfect and this still has like the little sewing from where the tag was in the store. So again, I got two pairs of these, exactly the same. The other pair is in the other bag. These were half off and these are Pilcro on the letterpress and they are the hyphen. They're size 28 and they're just these really pretty, like a relaxed fit, straight leg, with this pretty embroidery. And I don't know if you can see in the embroidery, there's like studding. And again, I thought these would be really cute spring jeans for someone. I feel like embroidered stuff does pretty well. I only had one other pair of embroidered jeans before, but they sold pretty well. This is not buttoned up, so I apologize. But this is just like a button up shirt dress. But this is a size large. It's J. Jill pure linen. So it's 100% linen. It's like this navy with a white stripe shirt dress and it has pockets. So this will be great for someone. I love picking up linen right now. Pure Jill Love Linen does pretty well for me. This is so funny. This is actually the brand Harry Potter. I don't know if you've ever been to the Harry Potter store, but these Harry Potter characters look like the Funko Pop Harry Potter characters. But I just thought it was so cute. Ron, a blonde Hermione, and Harry on their brooms and this is a size medium. I just thought that was cute. And Harry Potter stuff tends to do pretty well for me. This is made by Anthropology. I just wanted to get like some light springy pieces. And this is just a really cute pink and white print tank top. You know, I don't know that I'll get more than $18 for that or something, but I didn't pay very much for it. So that would be just fine. This I thought was cool. And this was half off. So I paid like a dollar for it. This is this really cool Nike with that perforated swish. And then the straps are different material and they say just do it on them. And then there's this like elastic thing holding the back ties together. Um, and this is a size medium, I think, yep. So I just thought, again, for spring, this is a great spring workout top, lightweight. And again, probably cost about a dollar. This I bought because of two things, novelty print and new with tags. So this is Talbot's, oh, and the size. This is a 1X, new with tags. It was originally $99. And when it was marked down, it was only marked down to $79.99. So it's still 80 bucks. And it's this really pretty, like three quarter sleeve, butterfly print, navy sweater. And again, if this doesn't sell, this could be mine. I think this would be super cute for spring. So new with tags things, good size. So I've been doing pretty well with Cupshe, and this is a Cupshe one-piece bathing suit. And it's so cute. It's got these black panels on the side, so it's slimming, and then that floral. And again, I do pretty well with Cupshe Swim. I just sold a piece. I have a piece that's got to go out today. This is size small, but again, one-piece bathing suits do better for me than when I have half of the bathing suit, so I wanted to try those. Here are the other pair of the same Madewell jeans. So it's 28 tall, 10 inch high riser, skinny, skinny. So I know skinny, skinny is not the best right now, but again, that high rise 10 inch seems to do pretty well for me. Okay, this, I've been dying to find a Patagonia one. This is not a Patagonia one, but it's close enough. And this is the other winter piece I got. This is L.O. Bean, size regular, but have any of you seen these? These are these down wrap skirts with snaps. How cute is that? 
So, you know, you could just throw this on over your ski gear. It's so cute. It has a little zip pocket in the back. And I have just been dying to get one of these. Now, this is a six regular, so this wouldn't fit me. But I just think these are so cute. And again, this was half off. And the skirt's like $4.99, so this is $2.50 for this awesome. And um, I just think these are so fun. And it's machine washable. Okay, so this store was sort of funny. When I first walked in, I was like, this is a mistake. You know when you go into a thrift store and you're like, uh, like I'm not going to find any gems? Well, this store, I really had to dig for the gems, but I found some. And here is one. Recognize these pockets? M4 Mother. These are mother, black, skinny, distressed jeans with a raw hem. And let's see. They're the Looker Ankle Fray, and they're size 26, and they were half off. So I paid $3.99 for these, I think. $7.49, $3.75, $3.75 for some mother jeans. Can't beat that. Oh, and then these, I have another pair listed right now, and they're not getting a ton of attention, but these are better size. These are size 28. And these are rag and bone, size 28. And they are like a high rise, just a plain high rise, skinny, um, you know, no distress or anything. But again, rag and bone jeans tend to do okay. It, they sit for a little while, but they'll sell. This is a brand I know doesn't do as well as it used to, but I still like to get it. And again, like I said, I like to add men's things. Untuck it, size small, and it's this really springy color, blue and green, check shirt and I just think that's adorable and while I don't love to list men's dress shirts sometimes when I see untuck it I gotta buy it all right again New England preppy Zoe comes out but this is great this is Vineyard Vines it's a double XL it was 50% off and it's just this gray quarter zip pullover with the whale just plain but such a great size, double XL. So I'm excited to get that listed. This was listed with the men's shorts. This is not men's. This is great. This is Athleta, size 12, and it's a squirt. And it's this really great, like, lightweight over material. And then the under material, like, mesh shorts. So this is great for summer because it's really, really lightweight. And again, a great size, size 12. And it's blue with that white stitch trim and the white trim on the pockets. I just thought that was so cute. And again, I know I've said it a million times, but squirts are doing pretty well for me. And now there's only two things left. So these are size 38 men's Patagonia shorts. I had like almost the exact same pair as these in a different size. These look like they're in really good shape. They also have like the stitching where the tag on the back was. So. You certainly can wash them like that, but these are don't look like they've gotten a ton of wear. And again, Patagonia does pretty well for me. It is short season. And last but not least, you know, when you see something and it doesn't look like much, but you just have that feeling because you're a reseller and you know. This is Lululemon. This is super cute. It's this long sleeve black, just ribbed shirt with that seam up the back. It's super cute. And I think this is one where I'm going to have to measure it because it doesn't have any bars or anything, but that's totally fine. Again, women's Lululemon long sleeve, super cute. So throw that in the wash and get it listed. So what do you think? I got over 20 things, which, you know, is kind of a lot for me. It used to be for a while. I was having a hard time getting 15 when I was going to my local store here. So I think I had a relatively productive morning considering I've been in posh chair jail since last night. So thank you so much for watching. Please comment down below. Let me know what was your favorite piece. If it was the mother jeans, I hear you because again, for less than $4, mother jeans, that's a pretty good find. And thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.